Hello, everybody. Hello. <coughs> Excuse me. We're hanging out in my kitchen today. I look rough. I know I look rough. Y'all look at me. If you're watching the replay, tell me your replay in the comments. Let me know you hung out. We're going to talk coffee today. So, have some afternoon coffee together. Try out this new stuff. I've had it since Friday, but I haven't felt like it. And everything has tasted yucky. So, hey, Shana. So, I was like scared to try the coffee. But I have it, and we're going to try it today. Hopefully, it tastes... I can taste it. How about that? I finally went back to the doctor myself this morning because I cannot take this anymore. I thought my head was going to explode. Fuck. Oops, sorry. I hit the wrong button. Okay, so um, Pharmacy came out with their new coffee. Was it about to try my... <laughs> <laughs> me go first. Look, I got the whole arsenal. So I got the creamer. I got regular sugar. I'm like, which we got the the additives. I don't know which way we're going with this. I'm gonna try it just plain first. Um, everybody keeps talking about how good it was, which is why actually why I went ahead and came on with it. I was gonna wait till tomorrow morning. Hey, Christina, I was gonna wait till tomorrow morning to try it, but I keep seeing people talking about how good it is, and I was like, well, I want to know. So we're gonna try it. So, this is Pharmacy's Neutral Plus Coffee. It is our um, health and wellness coffee. So, basically, stop, Dawson. You're going to break that. Why do the kids like to play with the water sprayer thing? So, it has extra stuff in it. It's based off of chicory. So, you like it? Hey, Christy, get out of all that. Stop. Um, it's chicory root is kind of the main showstopper here. So if you look at the benefits of actually chicory root, it's got a lot of stuff. So fiber, digestive, um, there's vitamins, all sorts of other things in it that are supposed to help. I personally am excited for the, um, the gut health because um, my intestinal tract is not the star player of my body. Um, it will do me dirty in a heartbeat. So I'm excited for that. And the on the weight loss side of it, it's more so that the chicory root has fiber in it. And that fiber makes you feel full. So you don't have all those cravings. You don't feel like you need to go eat the cabinet out. So for me, I'm probably, it's probably going to be one in the morning. Typically, I only drink one cup of coffee. But I'll do my one in the morning. And then if I get those three three o'clock cravings, I may come back and, you know, have a second cup and help with that, help have that fullness feeling. So we're going to try it. Mulan is going to help us out because you know I love her. I'm going to use my Keurig. So basically you just need hot water. It's instant coffee. Um, let's open it. We haven't, I haven't even opened it. I didn't want to get any germies on it until we all bitter. We did a hot and iced. I don't like iced coffee, y'all. I'm the weirdo that thinks coffee should bring, be drinking hot. Okay, so when I um, when I think of instant coffee, it's usually more granulated. This isn't. So this is like cocoa powder. I don't know if y'all can tell. Cocoa powder textured. So it's gonna be, it's not gonna be like when you get like Folgers or Maxwell House or something like that, instant coffee where it's a little more granular. Hey, Melissa, hope you're having a good time on your trip, girl. So you need hot water. Um, they said eight to 10 ounces of hot water and then can't wait to get yours. Yeah, girl, gotta get it ordered. So the, there was a misprint. It says two tablespoons. Um, there was some lost in translation between turkey and here. <laughs> so it's two teaspoons. And everybody's saying that that's pretty strong. So we're going to try it out. So I'm going to do, I'm actually going to do 10 ounces and two teaspoons. And I'm going to measure it. I'm actually going to measure it because I want to be able to tell people what I used and how I liked it. So you just need hot water so you can heat water up in the microwave. You can heat, go old school, put it on a pot. 
and heat some water up. I'm gonna use my Keurig. You can also, you can just add this to your regular coffee. So if you have a specific coffee that you really enjoy drinking, just toss this in and mix it up with it. Um, throw it in your Starbucks coffee. You're still gonna get all the benefits of it, just in whatever your favorite is. So we're actually using, hey Alicia, I saw your message. We're actually using my Keurig. There's no, I just don't put a pot in. I'm gonna do 10 ounces and let that pour out. I will say I got a new Keurig and it's kind of slow. It's kind of slow. Alicia, you know I'm gonna go reply to your message. Today has been an end. Let's see, your finger is in there. I shut the, you shut her finger in. <laughs> I wonder how you do it with iced coffee. So you just make it hot and then you just put it over the ice. Lexi shut her fingers in the cabinet. Mason. This, today, y'all, has been, <laughs> I'm telling you, it's been interesting. All right, go in there and sit down on the couch. Like, I go back to the doctor, and he, like, looked like I was crazy. I'm like, look, I've been dealing with this crap since Thursday. Can you have a little pity on me and give me something? Give me something. So, he finally did. We'll see. All right. We have our hot water. Hey, Libby. All right. So we have our hot water. Let's see if I can. So we're actually going to do. Oh, this is a great view of my gut. So hot water, then that, and then the ice and whatever. Yeah. Yep. Pretty much just so you can dissolve it. So I'm gonna do a straight two teaspoons. If y'all don't have one of these measuring spoons, you need to get one. Like this sucker slides with the measurements. I love it. It's my favorite. Okay, so two teaspoons and then we stir the coffee. And we dissolve the coffee. And hopefully we enjoy the coffee. No, I am not into all those foo-foo drinks. Like, I'm one of those people that like, coffee's coffee. What are y'all doing with all the other stuff? Could have caught you live. Yeah, I had it on mine. I hope it doesn't jack me up. So this coffee actually has it's like 60% less caffeine than most coffee, but the reason for that is because it this is 60% chicory root, 40% coffee, okay? So it's the two combined, but what gives you the boost of energy is the vitamins and stuff that are in it. So instead of getting like this false, like the straight just caffeine jolt, you're basically getting like a vitamin jolt. So it works a little different. So you, you'll see us say that it has less caffeine, but it doesn't mean it has less impact. It just has less of that. So if you're somebody that can't do caffeine, but you want a jolt, this may be the ticket. Um, I know for, like, for me, a lot of stuff jacks me up like crazy and I can't use it. Even my mom bought this cough syrup and it's nothing fancy. Yeah. Now that's the girls. I don't know where it is, but she bought this, this cough syrup for me. And y'all, I can't go sleep on it. Like I can literally take it that morning and it will jack me up the whole day. Shayna, I can't smell. <laughs> I mean, I can smell, but I can't smell. So what you're saying is coffee in one hand, Mountain Dew in the other. Girl, you need to get off the Mountain Dews. Get you some water. <laughs> I will tell you, I cut, have pretty much cut out sweets, and it's funny when you cut out the sugar, 
that things taste sweeter. Like, I couldn't even drink, um, we went to a birthday party the other week, and I couldn't drink the tea. And I didn't realize they had water at first, so I just got tea. I couldn't drink it, it was too sweet. What does it smell? I just got boogers in my coffee and pips. It smells good, it smells like coffee. It's got more of a, um, like a naturally earthy tea. You okay? Smell to it, what I can smell. I can't smell a whole lot of it. Sorry, sorry y'all. That has evaded me. All right, let's figure out what we wanna put in it. We can go Funfetti Creamer. We got vanilla syrup. Salted caramel syrup and mocha and sugar. I don't know, baby. I'm in the middle of something. I'm like scared of it. It's not bad straight, to be real honest with you. I could actually drink, like sip that. Shayna, you could actually probably do that black and not really add a whole bunch of hoopla to it. Let's see. It actually doesn't taste bad. I could drink that black. I've been struggling to find a coffee that I can drink black. I could probably drink that black. If you're somebody that likes all the um, caramel and whipped cream and all that, you're probably going to add something. But So this is salted caramel. Yeah, girl, you probably could do it black. So E2M people don't do um, additives. To, they don't do sugar and dairy. So I don't have the... But there's no calories. There's nothing in this. All I added was sugar, free, white chocolate, mocha, crema. You've got caramel. Yeah, you don't really need a whole lot. I'm kind of surprised. Kind of surprised. I'm not going to lie to y'all. Let's see what it tastes with that in it. Oh, my gosh. Y'all, that's good. I'm surprised. Okay, I'm not going to lie to y'all. Because I was a little nervous. I was like, should I try this coffee before I do a live? Because I don't want to go live and be like, you know, like, it's nasty. It's actually pretty good. It's actually pretty good. Like, black with a little bit of this. It's good. It's good. Shayna, go try yours. Go live. I'm looking out here. Shayna, you go live and you do your coffee. And I'll hop on yours. Because it's actually pretty good. When you get it in your mouth. Don't y'all like my spoons? Are they cute? I'm excited. This is pretty good. I'm glad we can have coffee together today. I'm going to get sit on the couch and enjoy my coffee. It's, it's good, y'all. I'm pleasantly surprised. Like, y'all, there's nothing in this coffee except some salted caramel. I'm excited. So there's no, what is it? There's like nothing in, there's really nothing in this coffee. All right, no fat, no saturated fat, no cholesterol, no sodium. There's two grams of carbs. And a, less than a gram of protein. And then there's iron, potassium, there's like vitamin A, vitamin E, vitamin C, all these other vitamins. Two, I would say two teaspoons to 10 ounces was a good ratio. Like it wasn't too strong, but it still had a kick to it. So y'all, if you would like a bag of your Nutri-Plus Trickery Coffee, and I'll tell y'all um, later what I think about, like how I feel. What I mean how I feel. So, we'll see. Yeah. There are around about, um, the back of the pack says 25 servings in this bag. 
More people are saying it's closer to like 22, but still. So the bag itself is $22 is what it retails for. Um, and then there's like 22 servings. So you're talking about a dollar a cup. So way cheaper. And it has extra benefits in it. Helps you feel fuller, has extra vitamins, helps with your digestive health, weight loss, all that. So, <laughs> excuse me. So I'm excited. All right, if you want a bag, let me know. Um, if you are close to where I live, then come by Saturday. I will have some extra coffee on hand for sale. So you can grab it and you won't have to pay shipping or anything like that because it's already there. And I'll see y'all soon. Bye.